Okay, this is Donald's Alphabet Chase. I've never seen this before today. Developed by Westwood. Okay, so I don't... The other Disney Donald game I played on Commodore was Donald Duck's Playground. That was Al Lowe and I believe Sierra. But we'll, we'll see what this one's about here. Um, am I in the wrong port? Honestly don't know. Enter the number of this Donald. Oh geez, is this copy protection? Okay, well, don't have the documentation. Although this says that it was cracked, so you would think it wouldn't matter. Alright, wow, this is uh, pretty complex. Okay, Donald's going after the D. What what is the object here? What am I supposed to be doing? Okay, got the D. Do I control him with the stick? I'm not real sure on what's going on here. Okay. So he just kind of walks around this room. There's Mickey Mouse on the TV. Wow, Donald's got hops. White ducks can jump. Okay. So I guess that's one area done. Apparently you don't use a joystick. You just hit the button when he's lined up with them and he catches them. That can't be all there is to this. Okay. Donald's chilling out. There's E over there, Donald. Go get him. So, let me not press the key here and see what happens. He slipped. Okay. <clears throat> so you hit the key. And then he walks over and grabs the letter. Alright. Alphabet Song and Twinkle Twinkle Little Star have the same tune, so don't be alarmed. Not that you would be. Surely this... It just goes all the way through the alphabet? Well, you know what? Let's just do a run through the alphabet then. That's... I'm capable of pressing K. I. Okay. I don't really know what makes this a, a letter chaser, I think it was called. Letter chase? Alphabet chase? He's not... He's just kind of walking around making a weird... Hey, like Bret Hart pose? Like... Mickey Mouse calendar back there. <coughs> That's okay graphics on Donald. You know, the backgrounds look okay. I don't expect any earth shattering, you know, they're not going to get like any of the big names to do music for this. Was it Rob Hubbard? Is that that guy's name? Okay, this looks like the boys' room from DuckTales. They had a bunk bed like that. Well, I'm not sure what the, the context of the letters being aliens is. Because there was no story. Well, maybe there is in the documentation that I don't have. But he touches them and then they are no longer sentient aliens. Maybe this is like a Pokemon crossover. Those are unknowns. Old school radio. Well, it's cool that it was at least that part of the song. Hmm. The thing I foolishly find myself getting frustrated about with these is the speed at which they play. 
but that's more my fault than anything because I feel like damn man this is slow but if I was a little kid trying to match you know keys on the keyboard maybe it wouldn't seem that way it probably still would because I know what a cue looks like but I don't know get him Donald what are you doing I like the graphic when he's looking up that's probably the best looking pose for him at least it looks the most like Donald Duck I don't like that shrug motion unless it's supposed to be like a dance the clapping Donald looks pretty good Is this gonna be the last one? B W X Y Z. Surprised he's not like in outer space or something. The backyard, big brick barbecue, a pool going. Man, that's a uh, pretty garish uh, swing set there. Like, looks like he's made out of like railroad crossing signs, the little bars. Cool reflection on the on the slide. Quit looking under there, dumbass. He's on the swing. There you go. Okay, we made it all the way through the alphabet, so what's next? If it just loops around, I am totally done playing this because well, it's not very engaging. Oh, Donald's plum tuckered out there. Okay. Poor Donald, gotta have a nap. The aliens came back. Darlene Waddington. I can't say I'm familiar with any of these people. Okay. Credit screen is nice for a Commodore game, though. Better than some crack screen that's like. Sh shout out to their other cracker homies or whatever. Because there actually were two cracker screens at the beginning of this, but like really, okay. So it just loops around. Well, that's Donald Duck or Donald's Donald's alphabet chase, Donald's letter chase. That's uh pretty basic. So not not super impressed. Uh, Donald Duck's playground is definitely wow. Donald got pissed. Oh, pissed off. Donald looks okay too. But not enough to sit through this. Well, let's see what happens if he misses all of them. He just sits on his ass and watches TV. You know? I guess it just loops till you do it. Well, Donald Duck's Playground is definitely a um, more engaging piece of software. So, of the two, I gotta go with that one. But, you know, this at least looks nice. But. I'd probably give this about a 4 out of 10 if I was giving it a score, so whatever. I'm going to go try to find some more weird stuff to look at, so I'll be back later. Thanks for watching.